Lori Baker is a professor and alumna at Western Illinois University who teaches women's studies and is able to tell us more about Women's History Month. Women's History Month used to be Women's History Week. About the mid 70s, um, there was some push, some grassroots push to make, turn it into something bigger and kind of institutionalize it. And then in 1987, Women's History Week was expanded to Women's History Month. This month is able to acknowledge what women did many years ago that have influenced today's society. We grew up as a country and a lot of that didn't make it into the history book. So one part of it is just understanding how what women have been traditionally encouraged to contribute wasn't really recognized. After teaching for almost 21 years, some of the problems women faced before are still relevant today. It was my firm belief that the things that I was teaching about, you know, as I was a press professor of women's studies, those issues would change. But really, quite honestly, the same things I taught about 20 years ago are the same things we're still teaching about. Women's history highlights the amazing things women have done, but there are problems that still need solutions. We're in transition. You know, we're trying to keep up with everything that's happening while still, I mean, Women's History Month's a great time to reflect on this while still recognizing, you know, what's happened before and what kinds of things have changed and what things haven't changed. Lori is thankful for the women that inspired and mentored her throughout her education process that now she is able to teach about a major that wasn't offered many years ago. In Macomb, reporting for News 3, I'm Yolo Tim Franco.